Korean pizza is like, I don't know what you like, so I'll just put everything on it. 안녕 everyone! Korea is heaven for delivery food. It's a country where food can be delivered to places you'd never expect. The best example is the Han River. You can order delivery food just like home at many Han River parks in Seoul. But how do I get delivery food when I don't have an address? Don't you worry. There are special delivery zones at the Han River providing a place to collect the delivery. It's always a crowded hotspot. If the weather's good, many people spread out mats or set up tents at the Han River and order delivery food. It's like camping but in the city center. You can rent mats and tents nearby and order food there, so you don't need to bring anything with you to have a good time. Then, what's the most popular delivery food at the Han River? Let me introduce them to you now. No filter K ranking chart Top 5 Han River delivery foods. Number 5 Korean fast food, aka Doksun tea. Dakbokki is Korea's most famous street food, but it never takes more than a single phone call to have it at the Han River. Dakbokki is rice cake cooked in red pepper paste and starch syrup. If you eat it with other food, you can experience the synergy of its flavor combination. Typically, people enjoy Dakbokki tea, which is a combination of Dakbokki, sundae, and deep fried food. Sundae is made with noodles in pig intestine, and it's a food that people love or hate. But once you're into it, you'll be hooked forever. You can enjoy various kinds of deep fried foods such as deep fried squid, seaweed rolls, vegetable and shrimp. Sunday and deep fried food are delicious by themselves, but they're more delicious if you dip them in the tteokbokki sauce. <laughs> it's a kind of fondue that can only be enjoyed in Korea. If you're good at eating spicy food and you want a challenge, try yeokdog. You will be able to taste the ultimate spiciness. After having a couple of bites, it's spicy, so you might stick your tongue out and gasp like a dog. <gasps> That's okay, the cool breeze from the Han River will cool it. In addition to the Dachshun tea combination, if the weather is chilly, you can order fish cakes with warm soup or kimbap for a proper meal. If you order lots of different Korean fast food at Han River, you'll try the different combinations and you will not regret it. Number 4 is Chokbal and Busam. Korea's most famous late night snack, chokbal and bossam, can also be delivered to the Han River. Since it's a late night snack, it can be delivered until late at night. Chokbal is a dish of boiled pork legs and seasoned soup. It's similar to Schweinshaxe in Germany, but Korean chokbal is chewier and softer. You can think of bossam as a well boiled version of grilled pork belly. It's nice because it's lean and plain. We can order chokbal and bossam alone, but we often order a combination of the two called chokbal. The great thing about this food is that it comes with free side dishes. First of all, if you eat chukbal and pusa, you also get a special kimchi that catches the greasiness of the meat. Makuksu comes with it as well. You could say it's kind of like a fresh, spicy pasta. You can experience all the different flavors like greasy, spicy, sweet, salty, fresh, and warm. Makgeolli is the best drink for chukbal and pusa, but isn't it a hassle to buy makgeolli? Not at all. There are many convenience stores at Han River. Don't worry, you can go back and forth a hundred times while you're waiting for your chukba to arrive. Number 3. Pizza Pizza is also one of the popular delivery foods. Freshly baked pizza can be delivered in less than 30 minutes to the Han River. You can take a picture of the Han River with a bite of pizza and the cheese stretching out against the bridge. You can try anything from world famous franchise pizza to Koreanized local pizza. The characteristics of Korean local pizza is its diversity. There are many different kinds of dough and topping. Not only does dough have various ingredients and thickness, but it also has cheese and sweet potatoes in the crust. Yum! It's so popular that it's exported to other countries. It's even more diverse when it comes to toppings. If American pizza leads in size, it's safe to say that Korea leads in toppings. There is potato pizza, seafood pizza, pineapple, and corn pizza. There is even pizza divided into four quarters, each with different toppings. Korean pizza is like, I don't know what you like, so I'll just put everything on it. You can taste all these different kinds of pizzas at the Han River. Number 2. Chinese food. 
If you go to the Han River, you'll find people sitting around each other, waving their chopsticks in the air. They're the ones who order Chinese food. There's a question in Korea that cannot be solved, like do you like mom or dad more? A similar question comes to the most famous Chinese food. Do you like jajangmyeon or do you like jjampong? Both are noodles, but the difference is that jajangmyeon is stir-fried with minced meat and vegetables in a black bean sauce. And jjampong is a spicy soup noodle dish with various vegetables and seafood. Sometimes I like jajangmyeon, but then I turn around and like jjampong. Especially if I order jajangmyeon, other people's jjampong looks very delicious. I never know what to do. For those who have a hard time choosing, there are some places that sell jajangmyeon and jjampong in one bowl called jjamjangmyeon, so don't you worry. Besides jajangmyeon and jjampong, you can order a variety of Chinese dishes. However, there will be a little bit more expensive. So when there are many people, they order a bowl of jajangmyeon and jjampong for each person. But they often order an expensive Chinese dish to share. It's an unspoken rule at Han River that goes on naturally without anyone saying anything. Number 1. Fried Chicken there are people who haven't tried it, but there's no one who has only tried it once. As expected, it's by far the best even for Han River delivery food. In particular, chimek, which is chicken and beer, accounts for more than half of the Han River's orders. Han River plus chicken and beer equals truth. It's a formula that you must know when you come to Korea. There are 103 chicken restaurants within a 1.5 km radius of Tuksam Han River Park. They're all heating up the oil waiting for you to call from the Han River. Maybe you can easily build a few tents from a day's worth of chicken leg bones from the Han River. Do you know that there are various kinds of Korean fried chicken? From original fried chicken to seasoned chicken, soy sauce chicken, garlic chicken and cheese sprinkled chicken, all these kinds can be delivered to the Han River. The sun could set before you decide what flavor to eat, so I recommend you decide before you go. Beer is the soulmate of fried chicken. You can buy beer from a nearby convenience store or you can order draft beer on delivery. It's nice to enjoy a canned beer that suits your taste, but I think you can really enjoy chimek. If you go to the Han River, make sure to try chimek. Take a picture of chicken and beer with the sunset in the background and put that hashtag on. This is Korea. But that's not it. You can also order lobster, salad, dessert, and even popcorn. Korean delivery is beyond our imagination. In addition to delivery food, the Han River holds a night goblin market from April to October. 125 food trucks open and sell a variety of foods. Delivery food, food trucks, the Han River is heaven. I hope you'll get to have a street side restaurant experience at the Han River. All right, see you in the next episode. Annyeong! Okay. <gasps>